Taking a page from an award-winning author, fourth grade students at Coos Elementary School are presenting best-selling author Jerry Pallotta with digital books they've written featuring exciting animal mashups, a concept inspired by his popular Who Would Win book series. I thought it was wonderful, very creative, and whoever thought of the art they used and the design and the mix of the animals, I thought it was great. So I was sitting there, I was thinking they were inspiring me, you know? I've been to over 100 schools this year, and I think it's the most creative project I've seen all year. So congratulations to all those kids. The students are excited to share their books with the author. My animal was a squid cub with a giant squid and an orca. This project was actually just really cool and really fun. Also, Who Would Win is like one of my favorite books, so it was really cool to make my own. For this collaborative book project, the students worked with district educational technology coaches in their science and ELA classes, as well as in the STEM lab. Before writing and researching could begin, each student was randomly assigned two animals and then used AI programs to creatively combine them into a single unique creature. My animal was a buffalo and an otter and together I made the buff otter. We cut off some of the bodies and then we combined them and then we used AI to like actually combine them and make them into an animal. Once they had their AI generated animals, the students gave them names and began researching the real-life animals behind their creations. They then work together, writing their books. My two animals were an anaconda and a mosquito. Together it's an anaconda, and his books are really inspiring to others, and the research helped me understand, like, what adaptations are, what features they have. My animals were ostriches, which was a mashup of a whale and a rhino. We kind of like collab together with the other person. This Who Would Win inspired digital book project took about three weeks to complete. At Coos Elementary School, Ron Lopes, Beaver County School District. So here's the mosquito, he's trying to bite the whale. 